What's up traders? This is V Trades and today I will be doing a technical analysis breakdown for NEO with the ticker symbol NIO. I will first be going over what I see on the daily chart and finish the video off with the weekly chart. So this is practically the same analysis as BABA, meaning this is still in bearish territory. Uh, we are a little overextended from the EMA, however, price is still under underneath this trend line that I drew and it still has not reached that mid $7 level, which was the prior strong support. We did come near the high sevens, but there's still a little bit more downside potential left for NEO. Uh, so I'm still looking for those targets, even if we do see a pullback. Uh, I guess in the short term, maybe we can see higher prices, probably to the 922 level. That's where the trend line is, and that's where the EMA will catch up to. And then we can see another drop lower. So until I see a lot of aggressive buying, something like right over here from June 1st up until June 16th. So if I see something like that, then that can change the picture. As of right now, this is not um, that bullish. This is still in a bearish uh, territory uh, for price to continue down lower. I would need to see a lot from Neo for me to be uh, changing my mind. So until then, I'm still looking for the mid $7 level. Uh, you can see the EMA is catching up. We're still below the trend line. Uh, this is still bearish overall. Until I see something drastically change, like aggressive buying occur on the chart, a break through that 1050 level would be something good. And then a small pullback can lead to another large leg up. So something like that. Um, so even if we do see a large leg up, it can still lead to another large leg down. So I want to see if, uh, a good move up followed by a small pullback. That will tell me that, okay, the, the aggressive buyers are back in the market and they're going to be pushing up the price. So until then, NEO is still bearish. So that's all I have for NEO on the daily chart. Let's take a look at NEO on the weekly chart. Here's NEO on the weekly chart. Not much has changed since Monday. Uh, this looks like a green week, so it could continue to push up uh, tomorrow and Friday. We'll have to wait and see. Uh, either way, uh, this is still not that great, and there could be more downside in the future. So again, NEO still has a long ways to, long ways to go. This entire drop since the all-time highs has been about 85%, 87%. And 89 at the lowest point. So again, this is still, um, you know, in bearish territory overall until we see a complete trend reversal, meaning higher highs, higher lows, something like this. Then we can start looking for uh, higher price targets. Until then, this is still not that great overall. So again, Neo, this is probably better than uh, being in this downtrend right over here in the past. Obviously, this is more sideways trading. So in the very short term, maybe we do see a little bit more upside, but there's a good chance it might fail for more downside. If it does break this trend line and break that EMA, then we can uh, work with something. This looks pretty good for the bulls, but until then, I'll be looking for more downside, looking for the 750 level uh, for NEO. Again, targets are not always reached. Let's just keep an eye on that. Make sure we have that in the back of our heads and let's see how this develops. So that's all I have for NEO on the daily and weekly charts, and I'll give you guys an update next week, Monday. This is V Trades, and thank you for your time.